Air signs, how if you're doing your love reading for 2024? February, let's see what we have for you. Mm. Okay. So, the Knave of Wands in reverse and the Emperor in reverse. Hmm. It seems like you aren't really starting anything new this month in love and it seems like something that was starting for you, one prospect. It's not really going anywhere right now with the Emperor in reverse. This person hasn't really... Mm, they haven't really tried to reach out and mm, professed their love or even they haven't done anything to prove um, or even signify how they are attracted to you or want to be with you. Mm, the sun is telling you that you don't need to give up on love right now or at least be pessimistic about it. Mm. What are the seven of pentacles? Mm. You need to put your energy in making money right now and focus on that. The page of arrows in reverse. Mm. You haven't really been putting a lot of effort in that department. Um, putting all of your effort into making money right now. And the ancestor is telling you that mm, it's divinely timed that you put mm, forth all of your effort right now into an opportunity that you know that would is essential for you right now but you're just hesitant and you're kind of hmm, you are just not being too productive and what's the word procrastination yes you are procrastinating and just being kind of lazy <laughs> um the king of cups and the two of wands all right so your the advice for you here is that the person that is right for you is gonna come around after a while and you just need to focus on yourself even if it's this person specifically they if they're right for you they will come around you just need to focus on the things that sustain you and right now you need to look at the long term for you in your finances or if you're in in education or whatever you're really putting um your effort in and things that you want to accomplish okay mm. the two of wands is telling you that you might have more options that you are looking at and it's telling you to mm, try to see if you can do more things with your time than just the things that you are focused on right now there are more opportunities that would be better for you possibly and mm, you're kind of limiting yourself to two options and while they are significant and you need to try your best at them there might be other things that you might be overlooking and not really mm, Trying your best in them. Tree of Vessels, the joy. Okay. So it's time to realize that your friendships, they you need to give time to your friends as well right now. So you they kind of bring energy to you and they give you some advice if you need a different perspective about things. Heartbreak and jealousy. Okay. So, someone who broke your heart, or at least a disappointment that came through someone, uh, this person, when you see them, you there is a lot of jealousy there, and their success basically makes you jealous, and you don't really want to feel these emotions, but they're just a part of what's happening right now. Okay, the last card the message for you from your guides is five of bows empowerment in reverse okay so you're really putting a lot of pressure on yourself but not really doing the work that you need to be doing 
and that kind of drags you down even further because you become paralyzed and stagnant because of all of the overwhelming emotions that you feel because of the procrastination so over time the procrastination is going to just pile up into a force of just holding you down and not really letting you move forward if that makes sense i hope this helped and we're moving on to libra gonna shuffle the cards quickly libra what do we have for you in love in february okay the seven of stones the healing and the page of stones links okay so there is a past connection that left you um, in a lot of pain and gave you a lot of hardship you are now beginning to heal from it and the page of stones it is telling you that hmm, you want to put effort into a new connection while of course you are accomplishing things and really putting forth efforts into just um, making the best of every opportunity that's coming your way but there is someone who hmm, It might be a masculine energy person who might be you might be partnering with. What is the message here for you for that? Okay. So you are determined to achieve a lot of things in this year and just make the most again of um everything that comes your way. The fool is telling you that you need to evaluate the opportunity that you're currently looking at and just weigh the pros and cons while it's something new and a new beginning while it has a lot of perks um, it would benefit you to be uh, prepared for the setbacks and it's it's a good opportunity but just prepare yourself that it might take time and um, whatever hiccups come your way you need to be prepared for them okay the judgment okay there is something that you are um, currently bearing the fruit of and the judgment of, if that makes sense, you, um, the reward of basically, whether negative or positive, that's just what the outcome is based on what you did in the past. And um, how is that going for you? The insecurity, okay. The seven of arrows, insecurity, okay. So it's leaving you the setbacks and or the whatever the reward is coming, whether negative or positive. It's the things that you have done already and the insecurity is telling you that because of it. And it's the things that um, they're just naturally there, but you are... Hmm, this is bearing heavy on you and it's just making you feel that things are not going your way and... You're just becoming overwhelmed and anxious about the things that are happening. The wheel is telling you that it is um, luck is on your side and it's just the things that it's the karmic cleansing and reaping the reward of the things that would happen now. It would be a new chapter and now when you put um, your foot forward for things, you will reap their reward, if that makes sense. Um, the thing is that now you have luck on your side so just and you already are making the best of the things that are coming your way so um it's it is not over um overtly overly positive i'm sorry um it's i don't know what to say but it's just it is what it is <laughs> these things is just part of life and you will come out on the other side bearing the fruits of your efforts so just keep at it and what are some messages for you from your guides i'm sorry i am just doing this at a very late hour and hmm. king of stones 
wolf okay the empowerment in reverse okay libra okay keep at it um again <laughs> we keep saying this but um the message really here is that you you should not get overwhelmed and um get paralyzed by your anxieties and just keep your momentum going and the empowerment universe is just telling you that right now things might feel that they're just um you aren't where you wanted to be in the past year you you felt that you had um some goals for yourself and you feel that you're not there yet it's just gonna take time and you're really building yourself up in this year it's just right now currently you don't really feel that empowered but um the rebirth is telling you that you will soon get to places that you want it to be and grow yourself it is a new beginning in many ways so make the best of it now we're moving on to aquarius no we did aquarius libra and gemini sorry just a moment Gemini we are okay the ace of bows the spark of life the the forest lovers okay okay the ace of bows and the forest lovers and the archer so for you love is it's a new start and you are learning about this person slowly both of you are coming um, out of the, you know, when two people meet, they're overwhelmed by how new the other person is. That's kind of the phase is now ending slowly because now you are acquainted with one another, so to speak. And um, now the quirks of each other are getting to you slowly that's just kind of how things go hmm the knight of vessels this person really cares about you gemini and there's just a lot of love here you share a lot of love you want to exchange just a lot of mutual um passion and compassion there's just really um warm fuzzy soft feelings here for one another and this person might be older or more experienced than you and it's just that they they feel that they're not able to give you so much time because of work and they want you to um realize that but they also feel for you because of um their experience really lends to how um they feel for you and they feel compassionate they feel, uh, feel the responsibility of being the more experienced person and they just feel insecure about how if they're not really giving you time you might just um, distance yourself a little bit these kind of things are going through their head and the wanderer the fool mm. okay so you are treading on new waters uh, and new lands so it's just, it's going to take time to get the hang of it. And these things, they're just, um, you realize that. And you will have to now. For this, the advice really here is that you need to busy yourself with things that, um, that are yours. And the transition is, it's happening. Um, everything that has happened, you are slowly adapting to it and it's just it's a matter of time let's see what the general message for you is 
Gemini. For you, um, this is a soul connection and it's just, it's going to bring you to new heights when it comes to on uh, your soul journey and the purpose shark. It is telling you that um, through this connection, because you have comfort um, of this connection and your heart is just at a place where you feel comforted and stable, you can now move on to pur your purposes. And again, it's t still um, again telling you that you need to um, put your energy and focus into things that are yours so you don't really feel so um, so heavy when they're not around and you don't really miss them so much because you're just distracted and busy when you are not you're both not busy you can come together and just be there for one another and share all the love and the compassion and kindness that you have for one another i hope this brings you some wisdom and um have a great day or night whenever you're seeing this